Okay, we're back. If you notice, I have a lower score. I should have, like, zero, but whatever. Um, I messed up a recording a bit ago, so I just got a game over to start here again. That was, that was right at the start of the level anyway. Um, whoa. Scarfies. Just got back from uploading the last video, so that should be all done. That's a big relief, because I'd never done that either. Oop. Oop. Very close to dying there. Cannons with umbrellas. And rocket ship things. What are those? Whatever. It's your kibble. He's a boomerang guy. He's in most Kirby games. And so is Waldo. Well At least a couple of enemies that are Kirby standards came from this game. Like most of the bosses are Kirby standards now, but not too many of the enemies from this game come back at least as enemies with powers. They don't have powers in this game. Killed another rocket ship thingy. Or spike or whatever it is. Secret. Bit. Heck yeah. Ow. Huh. Oh well. Pretty sure it's just for one life, but I'm still gonna get it. Even though it already cost me a life. Come here. Die. Oop. Almost fell. Ah. I'm surprised I haven't fallen into a pit yet. Falling is... Oh, there it is. One up. Falling is usually how I kill myself in Kirby games. I'll inhale an enemy and then fall over an edge without... Ah. Realizing I can't float after I inhaled an enemy. Ah. I swear in this game, Krakow Jr. is harder than Krakow is because... Patterns a little more. Difficult to dodge. Krakow's the eyeball cloud guy we just fought. Mint. At least I think it's a mint. I'm pretty sure that's what I remember from the manual anyway. Been a few years though. And tomato. Uh, oh well. Not like I can actually use it anyway. Scurfy. Ooh, spicy. If you notice, there's a block um, that I can inhale over here. I don't know if that's a secret or something, because I can't seem to get to it, but I don't know. I do remember another secret that's way up here. There it is. Oop. And hit the umbrella. Wee. Fall through the atmosphere. One up. One up. Aw, uh, only two. More than enough, though. Cracko. Ah. 
So, Gark actually requires some pretty good timing in this one, but other than that, you could pretty much stand still. I would have been fine there if I didn't inhale the stupid waddle do. Just really wait to make sure he's not going to jump. Not now. You're not that tough. It. Only once. Hmm. Ah. Ah, shouldn't have hesitated. Ah! Jeez. I probably would have beaten you by now if you didn't freak me out that first time. Bite. There we go. There you go. Go that way instead of running right through me. Phew. That's better. Ah! Can't catch me. Aha. Uh -huh. Boom. Gotcha. Dee 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 doo. Boop. Mount dee dee dee. Dee 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 dee. Dee dee theme was always one of my favorite. Well, pretty much my favorite video game song ever. It's not... Well, it's sort of half length in this game. It's a bit longer when um, you hear it in Kirby Superstar or in a, any of the later games. But that may be because it's on the Game Boy. Maybe the song has to be shorter or something. Now we go through the boss rush mode. It's sort of odd to see in a Kirby game. I don't think they usually make you do this. It's more of like a Mega Man game type thing. Which be still ridiculously easy. Oh. Not even gonna go bl blow wind at me. Oh, that's that mask. Wanna go evil? There you go. I love it does a little dance when we touch him. Oh. Half of the boss is down. Ah. Took a shell. Didn't want to kill you anyway. These little levels are a lot shorter than I remember them being. I thought I remembered DDD stage taking forever, but I guess not. Uh oh, looks like we're about 10 minutes. Um, 
I guess I should be able to fit in the last two bosses real quick. Blue it takes no time at all. Ha. Yeah, Kirby, when you're falling a long distance, you can head bonk your enemies. Um put crack those real quick here. Ah. I better not risk it, I'll just pause here and we'll continue the video with DDD next time.